the James Webb Telescope has identified six galaxies that exist half a billion years after the Big Bang that are up to 10 times bigger than the Milky Way galaxy. The James Webb Space Telescope, known as the Webb, is a groundbreaking instrument that surpasses the Hubble Space Telescope's capabilities by a factor of 100. When we examine the images it captures, each dot represents an entire galaxy containing around 100 billion stars. This remarkable telescope has unveiled a plethora of captivating images, including breathtaking views of spiral galaxies, nebula, and glimpses of exoplanets that might be conducive to supporting extraterrestrial life. One of its primary scientific goals is to observe the period when the earliest galaxies are believed to have formed, enabling us to gain a deeper understanding of their origins, evolution, and composition. Recently, the web has made a startling discovery that could potentially rewrite our understanding of the universe's inception. With each successive look back in time, the telescope appears to shatter its own record for the farthest galaxy ever observed. It has revealed thousands of galaxies that bear a striking resemblance to our Milky Way galaxy, complete with their exquisite disks and delicate spiral arms. What's astounding about this revelation is that these Milky Way-like galaxies were initially observed more than 10 billion years ago, weaving their way through the cosmos. This discovery is profoundly surprising because these galaxies were not expected to exist in the early universe. Even more astonishing is the fact that scientists generally assume they must must possess favorable conditions for the emergence of life, much like our own Milky Way, which suggests that life might have originated in the universe much earlier than previously thought. Join us today as we delve deeper into these remarkable galaxies and explore why this discovery holds such immense significance for the field of astronomy. Since its launch in late 2021, the James Webb Space Telescope has predominantly focused on peering into the farthest reaches of space seeking clues about the early universe's evolution. When researchers initially directed the web toward seemingly empty regions of the sky to hunt for these distant galaxies, they stumbled upon an unexpected treasure trove. It turned out that there were far more of these ancient galaxies than anyone had anticipated, some dating back as far as a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. According to a recent study conducted by an international team of researchers, the web has uncovered over a thousand galaxies in the early universe that bear a striking resemblance to our Milky Way. These Milky Way lookalikes exhibit the distinctive features of spiral galaxies, boasting well-defined disks and delicate spiral arms. This revelation challenges the previously held belief that such small galaxies could not have expanded during the early universe due to violent galactic mergers. It's worth noting that recent research indicates that these disk galaxies were 10 times larger in the early universe than previously assumed by astronomers. For over three decades, it was widely believed that disk galaxies were a rarity in the early universe, primarily due to the frequent and turbulent galaxy interactions they were thought to experience. However, this unexpected discovery adds to a growing mystery surrounding the early development of large galaxies and, by extension, the potential for life to emerge in our universe. The fact that the web has identified so many of these galaxies underscores the instrument's remarkable capabilities and suggests that galaxies formed much earlier in the universe than previously imagined. The prevailing theories about galaxy formation typically kickstart between 1 and 2 billion years after the universe's inception. At this point, it was believed that the initial star clusters began their transformation into dwarf galaxies, which eventually merged through violent interactions. After approximately 10 billion years, these mergers led to the formation of massive galaxies resembling our own Milky Way. The Milky Way, with its characteristic spiral arms and sombrero-like shape, is one of the most common types of galaxies in the current cosmos. However, scientists had long predicted that galaxies like the Milky Way would have their shapes significantly altered during the universe's early stages, characterized by a higher density of galaxies and an abundance of dwarf galaxies. Yet, when astronomers turned the web's gaze back in time, roughly 9 to 13 billion years ago, they made an astonishing discovery. Out of the 3,956 galaxies observed, 1,672 were disk galaxies akin to our Milky Way, even during this early epoch. 
These findings challenge the prevailing notion that most disk galaxies should have been distorted by violent galaxy mergers during this time. The significance of this discovery lies in the fact that disk galaxies, with their relatively stable structures, are believed to be particularly conducive to the emergence of life. Their gravitational properties are advantageous for the formation of planets, raising the possibility of many more opportunities for the development of alien life. However, this finding also compels us to reevaluate our understanding of the universe's origins. Until recently, it was believed that disk galaxies were virtually non-existent until the universe reached an age of roughly 6 billion years, a discovery made possible by the Hubble Space Telescope. The Webb's groundbreaking findings pushed the emergence of Milky Way-like galaxies almost to the very beginning of the universe, which prompts questions about the mechanisms of galaxy formation and the overarching changes that have occurred over the past 10 billion years. This discovery also raises intriguing questions about the origin of large galaxies and, by extension, the emergence of life in the universe. Given that our own Milky Way is a disk galaxy, this revelation implies that both may have emerged far earlier than previously thought. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to detect these ancient galaxies is attributable to its use of infrared wavelengths, which allow it to identify galaxies that are incredibly distant. The Hubble Space Telescope primarily operates in the optical light wavelength range, which corresponds to what the human eye can perceive. Consequently, Hubble had only detected a limited number of extremely distant galaxies. Redshift is the phenomenon in which a galaxy's light shifts toward the red end of the spectrum as it moves farther away from us due to the universe's expansion. The light from these extremely distant galaxies that early universe researchers are interested in has been redshifted to the extent that it can only be observed in the infrared spectrum. This made it challenging for Hubble's instruments to detect these galaxies, in contrast to the web, which managed to spot many of them within just a few days of commencing its scientific operations. Astronomers typically categorize these galaxies based on their age rather than their distance from Earth. For instance, they refer to a galaxy as being from the first few hundred million years after the Big Bang, rather than stating its distance as thousands of billions of light years away. This approach stems from the universe's expansion, which introduces a shifting frame of reference that complicates distance measurements. In light of these discoveries, it becomes apparent that the majority of stars form and exist within galaxies like our Milky Way, fundamentally altering our understanding of galaxy development. These findings necessitate a revaluation of theories about the universe's origin and the evolution of galaxies over the past 10 billion years. Moreover, this revelation raises captivating questions about the genesis of large galaxies and, by extension, the potential emergence of life in our universe, given that our own home, the Milky Way, is a disk galaxy. What are your thoughts on the groundbreaking discovery of Milky Way-like galaxies in the early universe by the James Webb Space Telescope? Do you think this revelation could significantly impact our understanding of the origins of the universe and the potential for extraterrestrial life? Engage with us by leaving a comment, subscribing to our channel, and clicking the notification bell for regular updates. Keep watching, stay inspired, and get ready for more exciting discoveries. See you in our next episode.